Okay, in the last demo, we created a Visual Studio Team Services account using a new Outlook.com account, Microsoft account. So we used our Microsoft account that we newly created for Pro Data Man demos to create a Visual Studio Team Services team project. Now this team project was automatically created just because we created a Team Services account. You can see here it's called My First Project. We are going to use Visual Studio to connect to our Team Services account and then add some code to our new My First Project project. So let's bring up Visual Studio. And in Visual Studio, we'll go into the Team Explorer. And from the Home drop-down here, we'll go to Projects and My Teams and Manage Connections. So we're going to use Manage Connections, Connect to Team Project. And in the dialog here, we're going to switch user, new user. So we're going to use the Pro Data Man at Outlook.com account. Enter our password. And now it's telling us that we do not have the necessary credentials or the account does not uh, have permission to connect to the Team Foundation server at ProDataManVisualStudio.com, but that's because that's the production account. We're going to come over here into the Add or Remove Team Foundation server. We are going to use the URL ProDataManDemos.VisualStudio.com. asking us for our sign in again so we're going to use pro data man at outlook.com and add our password and now that we've added that server to visual studio we can connect to it and select my first project. Now we can connect Visual Studio to our new Team Services account and we can add some code. Now you can see here in Visual Studio that we're linked to our new Team Services account and connected to our My First Project project. And our Team Explorer is looking at that same connection. watching. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down below. Also, be sure to check out one of the related videos off to the side over here. If you really enjoyed it, you can help out by sharing the video on Facebook or Twitter. Encourage your friends to subscribe. Thanks again.